It's a bit big. Y'all like these coats? Welcome to the first episode of opening up a bunch of uh, booster packs and hoping we get something good. Now, if you're not familiar with the Pokemon franchise and how the card system works, this little guy has a black circle at the bottom, and that means he's common. Now, if you find something that has the little diamond in the bottom, see if we can get a good shot at that. Let's see if we can get a good shot of that. All right, cunt. Now, if you find a card that has a little diamond at the bottom, that that means it's uncommon. You can't see it, but trust me, it's there. And then, there's little cards with stars at the bottom, and that means it's rare. However, Starmie is not rare. So we say goodbye to him. Now, this that you see before you is the trash pile. This is all of the cards that, essentially, I don't give a shit about. Oh, shit. I wonder what's in here. Doesn't look like a Pokemon card. Is this Yu-Gi-Oh or something? Ancient Mew details. Name of attack. I need a pen. Yeah, let's say that card's looking pretty nice. Anyways, all we got was this piece of shit. I mean, I guess it's hollow, so... It doesn't look like a real card, though. It might be fake. Yeah, whatever. Anyways, what we'll be looking for in this episode, in order of least to greatest... First, you got your reverse, which means it has this shiny little glow, and it looks pretty. We don't give too much of a shit about them. Come on. Then we have rare reverses. Then we go to hollows. Then we have EXs. Then we have mega EXs. It'll have that big M at the beginning of the name. There's also full art EXs. This is a Whale Lord EX. And as you can see, it's textured, it looks pretty, and he's a big old, big old whale. That's his thing. That's his thing, Charlie. Then we have full art Mega EXs, which are the rarest at the moment because they have a golden border, they look very pretty, and they have the texture. Then we have brakes. Brakes are pretty. They have a lot of hollow stuff on them, and they're golden. We have golden trainer cards. This is 108 out of 108. However, typically trainer cards like this that have the golden borders can also be secret rares. That's another thing that we'll be looking for. So if I had 109 out of 108, that would be considered a secret rare. And that's essentially the rarest thing you can get. However, in the evolutions packs, all of the secret rares are extremely common, so we're not going to give too much of a shit about them. Today we are going to be opening 10 evolutions booster packs. Cost me about 50 bucks. It was a pretty bad investment. First one of the day, open you cunt. So the typical tactic for opening these, here's, here's some codes, is one, two, three, move them to the front, and then you're good. So we got the Whirl, Maintenance, Haunter, I actually really like Haunter, Nidoran, Seal, Diglett, Poliwag, Sandshrew, and Magmar Reverse, and then... Hey, wait a second. Hold up a gosh darn second. That's the card I just showed right before, but the... Why does the one on the left look shittier? I don't know if you guys can see that, but it looks like... It's tinted a little more shitty. Whatever. That is our first good card of the day. Now on to pack number two. There's no such thing as delicacy with opening these things, by the way. That cardboard shit can fuck off. There's a code, trainer card, Tremeleon, Charizard Spirit Link. By the way, a lot of these cards I used to actually own when I was little, which is why I really wanted to open the Evolutions packs. Uh, I remember having, like, this identical card. Even this Charmeleon I remember having. It's a fucking blast from the past. It, uh, if you're not familiar with the Pokemon Evolutions packs... They literally reprinted a lot of the old art, like for Onyx, this is the original art when they released the cards back in, what, 95? Except the difference is, health is different, the attacks are a little different, they switch a little things up, like Clefairy is now a fairy type. So we got Onyx, 
Star you. I remember having this little motherfucker, and I remember him still being worthless. You know what? Fuck him. We got an original fat Pikachu before he slimmed up. Doduo. Ponyta. Electabuzz reverse. And then an Arcanine. Now this motherfucker, even though there's a star at the bottom and it says he's rare, this is one of the most common things you will ever find in these goddamn evolutions packs. So we're just going to give him the rip treatment. We move on to our third pack. I hope it's good. Code. We got a full heel trainer card. We got a Machoke. This guy I actually thought was one of the coolest cards back in the day. Just because his art is so, I don't know, bold, stylistically. Pokemon really knows how to make fluffy things fluffy and buff things buff. It's a lot of good furry porn inspiration to be had in Pokemon, all in all. We have the original Switch card, Magnemite. Fat Pikachu again. Machop. Weedle. Dadu. We got a full heel trainer card, and then... Ooh! That's a Blastoise EX, it's not half bad. Of course, it's not a full art, I would have preferred that, but anyways, that's still some some decent pulls for for uh, getting into our third pack now. I have no idea how I'm going to arrange those things, by the way, it's just going to be a mess. Fourth pack. Let's hope we don't get fucked by Arcanines again. As always, code. Now we got a Haunter. A Revive. That's not a secret rare. Missy's turn... <laughs> Yeah, another Poliwag, Diglett, Seal, Nidoran, Ponyta, a Reverse Mewtwo. I have like 10 of these guys, so you know what he gets. I'll leave him be. Yeah. Fuck him. Fifth pack. You know what? I, I gotta prove this to you guys that I actually have like 10 of him because... I just ripped up two Mewtwo's and people are going to rage at me for that shit. Hold up, guys. I, I swear, I have it. Alright, guys, so I can only find the one. These are for proof that the two other ripped up ones. I have, like, seven others, but I can't find them right now, so trust that I have them. Pack number five. I'm feeling the luck with these, because uh, Evolutions seems to give you a lot of good shit for no reason. The breaks and EXs and full art EXs are actually pretty abundant with these. So we start off with Blastoise Spirit Link, Pidgeot Spirit Link, Kakuna, Staryu, Onix, ooh, ooh, Growlithe, Staryu, wait, is that two Staryus in one? You know what they get. We got a Charmander, a Blastoise, I mean, what am I saying, a Venusaur Spirit sp sp Link, oh, and then another full art Venusaur, that's pretty okay, I guess. I didn't really want another one, but we got it. Yay! Just gonna put him right there. Pack number six. Oh shit, guys, you're not gonna believe it. I've got more cards to put in the fuck pile. Just found them fresh. Shit, Where, where's the pack? There it is. Pack number, what, six? Yeah. Oh, this is some intense opening. We're taking out the... Just the clear plastic. Now that is a fresh pack opening. Let's rip this bitch open. Oh shit, I just realized. I, I kind of swamped the, the Blastoise and Charizard and Venusaur we got. Uh-oh. scooby dooby doo Where are you? Chari Charizard. Where are the, the yard? Shit, we lost Charizard. But you know what? It's, it's, it's all good. Cause we're going to put him right up there. By the way, this isn't actually a bit. I actually lost the Charizard card, so we're just gonna put the other one I already had up. Anyways, back to opening cards. There's there's a code for you if you want it. So we have a Charizard Spirit Link. We have Double Energy, Machoke, Magnemite, Caterpie, Rattata, the only fan art, or I guess not fan art, the only official art that they make him look anywhere near cool. I always thought that he looked a little bit noble in this picture just because he's got his chin up and everything and his his teeth are sparkling. Charmander, Ghastly, Kakuna Reverse, and then a Farfetch'd as our rare for the pack. 
Pack number seven. All right, let's not throw that shit down anymore because I'm actually gonna lose track of even more of these that I'm getting. Get out of there. So we have our code. One of you sons of bitches is gonna get all of these codes probably. But anyways, we get a revive, haunter, Brock's grit. That's uh, that's stay up there, you little cunt. We got Brock's grit, which is not a secret rare. It's just 74 out of 108. Ponyta, Sandshrew, Vulpix, Nidoran male, Growlithe. Uh, actually, I haven't seen a Nidoran female yet out of all of the packs I've gotten. I would beg the question if they even reprinted the Nidoran female, because I know for a fact that they didn't reprint the original Blastoise, that would have been your Rare Hollow, and then the original Venusaur. Those are just gone in the wind. I got a Charizard Hollow from these packs, but that was it. That was a Growlithe, and then we got a Reverse Double Energy, okay. and my Champ Hollow. That's actually pretty nice looking. Look at that Guido ass buff McManley dude with four arms all ready to fist you up the ass. Just gonna put him right up there. Oh shit, where did Venusaur go? Oh, there he is. Whew. So this is number eight. Code. One, two, three. And the reason that we do the one, two, three thing is because uh, you take three cards from the back. I forgot to explain this. You take three cards from the back and you are guaranteed that the last two cards will be your reverse and your rare. So. If you're going for build-up, then that's the best way to do it. And we have our first secret rare, which is the Flying Pikachu. I'm not actually sure if I already had this one. But there's Flying Pikachu, there's Surfing Pikachu, and s some other Pikachu doing a random act that will surely get him killed. There's no electricity bullshit that's going to save him from this. He, he fucking signed up for this, and he's going through with it. And you'll see he is... 110 out of 108. So we got Flying Pikachu, Coughing, Misty's Determination, Regular, Voltorb, Magnemite, Caterpie, Charmander, Diglett, and is that a Starmie I see? No, it's a Dugong. However, Dugong is still pretty shit, so... I wonder how many people are just getting tilted on ripping up these cards left and right. Like, there's... Nick, Dusa, there's so many kids who would love to have these cards that you're ripping up. Are they here? Do I know them? No, I don't. Therefore, do I give a shit? Only a little. So this is pack number nine. Some would call it the mightiest number. There's your card code. One, two, three. Up to the front. We have a uh, devolution spray, Metapod, and he has Stiffen, which is a little bit more sexual sounding than Harden. Professor Oak's Hint, Diglett, Seal, Nidoran Male, Ponyta, Doduo, Vulpix Reverse, with a Confuse Ray, and then... Clefairy Hollow! That's actually pretty good. I kind of wanted that. I think I, I got a... the Blissy? Blissly? The, the big pink fuck. The other big pink fuck with the egg in its... in its uvula. I got that thing in Hollow. So I'm gonna put him right up there with Charizard, overlapping, because I don't know where else to put these shits. And then we have pack number 10. The final one. If this one isn't... Good, then we're ripping up the whole pack. Oh, already off to fantastic start, a water energy. There's your code. One, two, three. So we have Revive Trainer Card. Here comes Team Rocket. That's another one of the secret rares. It is 113 out of 108. I don't think you're going to be able to see that. Let me see. Yeah, you may or may not be able to see that. I can't tell. But here comes Team Rocket. That is another one of the secret rares that are extremely common because of how many are out there. You got a Magmar, Energy, Growlithe, Machop, Voltorb, Diglett. Yeah, we're just blowing through this one. A Magmar, and to wrap it all up,
These aren't any rares, right? Yeah. Rattata. The code. Fuck them all. Farfetched. Fuck them. Electabuzz. Fuck them. But anyways, guys. Thanks for watching. These were pr some pretty decent pulls, actually. We got a Charizard EX, Clefairy Hollow, Machamp Hollow, Blastoise EX, and then a Full Art Mega Venusaur EX. That's all pretty good, actually. I was expecting a lot shittier than that. I was expecting maybe a maybe a few a few more uh, one of these date rape fellas. But yeah, thanks for watching. I might do more of these videos if this actually gets any traction whatsoever. Uh, just wanted to do this because I have fun collecting Pokemon cards. I'm not too serious about it, though. I just like looking at pretty cards. It's just, she's, she's pretty. But anyways, uh, thanks for watching, and fuck if I know how to end the video.